guys welcome back to my channel i have not filmed in over a week i was feeling under the weather for a little while i was getting a little nervous with everything going around but i'm feeling much better now i am back a little bit late but we're gonna do it anyways i am gonna share what is in my kids easter basket i have four girls um my oldest is six my next is four my middle child is two and my youngest is almost 10 months old so we have a wide variety of different baskets here to share but i'm just going to show what i have for everybody um i'm going to start with the baby's basket um this is leo's basket i got everybody a easter outfit and i really wanted to get <clears throat> i really wanted to get leo a matching outfit but of course I couldn't find her size. So this is what Leo's gonna wear. So I'm gonna put this like on the top of her basket, just a cute little outfit. I got it from uh, Target online. Um, this is a little lamb for her. I got this on Michael's drive up. I was not prepared for Easter at all. So I tried to do as many drive ups as I could and just like get what I could. So I found these little ducks on Target drive up. Um, I got this book for her, um, and then I found these things at Walmart today, this little teething ring for her. She has like four teeth popping through on the top, so this will really help her. And then just this little frog ball. She loves balls. She'll, she'll love that. And then I found this little dress actually at Walmart, which Walmart sometimes has some hits. So it's so cute. So that is her basket. Okay. So this is the dress that I got for all the girls. All the girls have this dress. This is Harper's. She is in a 2T and it's from Target. It's so cute. I really want Leo to have it, but um, the, Leo has this color on her dress. So they're like coordinating. Um, but this is the book that Harper got, 10 Little Ladybugs. We used to have this book and the girls used it until it fell apart. So I got it again for Leo. Um, this is a nightlight. I got this in the Target dollar section. Uh, some little bunny socks. I got these in Michael's drive up. She got peeps. She also got this little art coloring set. Just because her sister's got one, I wouldn't typically buy this for a two year old, but whatever her sisters do, she's gonna do too. So she got that. She also got slime. I'm gonna regret this. She got some jelly beans and she actually got two coloring books. I don't know how this happened, but she has two of them. She has a Trolls from Trolls World Tour. She has a microphone. She has two things of bubbles. And then she also has a baby bottle pop, a little M&Ms. And then she actually has two of these little unicorn things. When I ordered these, I thought it was just gonna be one big one for Harper. You'll see the other girls have like some different things, but this came in a pack of four. So the other girls got one and then Harper got two. So that is Harper's basket. Oh, no. And then she also got a fishing rod, which you'll see all the girls got a fishing rod. They've been going down on the creek with Jared, so we saw some fish today. So they were asking, we go fishing, we go fishing. So we got some fishing rods. Let's get a Lily's basket. Lily has the same dress. Um, Lily has egg chop I just tried to grab something most of these things the girls are all gonna use they're all gonna share so it doesn't really matter but I just try to not get the same thing for everything she also got two bubbles I got it in a six pack so they all got two um she got a little unicorn to paint she also got bunny socks she got some Crayola markers they needed more markers so I just threw them in her basket you'll see Bailey has something different, which is like a little activity that it's definitely more for Bailey, but the little girls will use it too. This is Lily's book. I need a new butt. This is very much Lily. Um, she got this coloring book. Lily also got a little pair of sunglasses that I found in the dollar section. At Target, she got the same Starburst jelly beans that Harper got, and she also got peeps that Harper got. Um, she got this stretchy carrot thing. I got it in Michael's drive up. It feels so 
Anyways, she got this stretchy carrot. Um, she also got slime like Harper did. She got some pencils. Important. She got Hubba Bubba. They have been asking and begging for bubble gum. I am going to regret this, but they are getting bubble gum. She got a little unicorn thing. Um, she also got M&Ms and a baby bottle pop. Um, and then she got the same fishing rod that Harper got frozen. I couldn't decide. They had like Princess and Moana, but I sometimes I can't decide whether I should get different or just get them all the same because they're going to argue over it anyways. And then this I feel like is so extra. It obviously doesn't fit in the basket, but I'm justifying this by the fact that the girls are stuck at home and they are so bored. They need things to do. They need activities. So Bailey and Lily both are getting games. Um, Lily's getting this thing called Baba Bubbles. I don't know. It looks similar to uh, the soggy dog game, but it's like bubbles instead of water. So we'll see if they like that. And let's move on to Bailey's basket. The last basket is Bailey. She is six going on 25. So this is her basket, but she pretty much has the same thing as her other sister. She has the same dress as her sisters. She has the same fishing pole, Frozen 2. Like I said, we all got the same. Um, <clears throat> in her basket, the book I picked for her is What Should Darla Do? I think this is like a situational book where she can read the book and decide like if she picks one way, then you turn to this page and whatever. It's like different stories combined. So I think she'll really like that. Um, this is a little, it says stationary set spring. I got it in like the dollar section at Target. It was five bucks. Just has like a little journal papers, a little stencil tape. Like she's super into um, just like journaling and arts and crafts. And she's always making little notes and little things to give to people. So she will love this. <clears throat> um, and then I also got her, um, this is what I was talking about, how Lily got the little stretchy carry thing. Bailey got this tic-tac-toe. Um, she loves tic-tac-toe, so she will really like this. Bailey's socks are, um, butterfly. I did these, uh, Michael's drive up, so I didn't get to pick who got what. And, like, when I picked the picture, there's three different ones, so I figured I would get three different ones. But, of course, I got two of the same and one. But whatever. Bailey got these ones. Um, stuck with the butterfly theme. So Bailey got the butterfly little paint set. And then Bailey also got the same thing as her sisters. The peeps and the jelly beans. These are Bailey's bubbles. Can't leave her out on bubbles. Even if she's sick, she still needs bubbles. Um, she got a little coloring set. Which I think it has more than just coloring. Okay, no, it's just coloring. <laughs> um, and then she also got pencils, just like Lily did. I just split the pack. Um, she got slime. It was actually, I literally find, found three left. So I was like, okay, yes, I have to buy them. She got Hubba Bubba, just like Lily did. She got M&Ms. I bought my kids so much candy. It is so unnecessary. I spent over $30 just on candy for their baskets, not even on candy for eggs. Okay, I spent, I have a problem. I got a baby bottle pop, and then she got a little unicorn just like her sister did. Um, and then this, she got these little bead sets. I remember doing these all the time. They're these like little beads that you put on the little stencils and then you iron them once you're done with them. So these will be super fun. And like I said, um, all of her sisters will use this, obviously other than Leo, but they will all share this, but this is definitely more Bailey's speed, so Bailey's gonna get this. And then Bailey got Twister Scrabble. Um, I'm not sure that her sisters will be able to play this, but maybe this will be super fun to play one night when like we just put her sisters to bed, or at least her little sisters to bed, and her and Lily can try to play this. Um, it says for eight plus, but Bailey is, super smart so I have no doubt that Bailey will play this no problem so I'm gonna show me putting the baskets together really quick I'm actually gonna show you guys quickly what candy I got for the eggs um because I went a little overboard but yeah I'm gonna quickly do that and then I'm gonna show me putting the baskets together
Okay, so this is what the final baskets look like all laid out. Oh, okay, well, let's do that. Okay, that's a little bit better. Anyways, this is what they look like. This is Bailey's. Um, I just wrote their names with puffy paint just because they're all the same, just so they can tell them apart. I think it looks really cute. Um, yeah. I think I'm going to hide them somewhere, so I'll record that when I do hide them. But I am going to stuff the eggs now and set up the table upstairs and hang the little banner that I have. So I'll record that quickly as well. Okay. So Jared is actually going to fill these eggs for me. He's going to clean up the basement. He just cleaned this bathroom down here. It looks so good. He did such a good job. I'm actually going to go upstairs to the kitchen. I'm whispering because it's like 1230 at night, but I still have quite a few things to do so i'm gonna go upstairs to the kitchen i made a cake earlier that i'll show you guys and i need to ice it quickly it won't take long and i'm going to peel and cut up the potatoes for i'm gonna make mashed potatoes for dinner tomorrow um so i'm gonna peel and cut those up really quick Anyways, back to what I was saying. <laughs> Before I really got about these are the lemon cakes I made. I'm gonna ice them. So I think I'm gonna cut, cut up the potatoes the first, or peel them and cut them up first, and then I will ice the cake and clean up. Hopefully, I can do it relatively fast because I'm tired and I want to go to sleep. Okay, so if you're wondering why I peel potatoes and cut them and put them in this container, um, I just prepped for mashed potatoes that we're going to have for dinner tomorrow. I just would much rather um, prep tonight than spend all day cooking. So I did that. And then I also earlier prepped this bowl of... about the fact that I need to do a crumb layer and then I need to put it in the fridge for a little bit and then I need to do another layer. Um, so that's why it looks like so janky. Like this is the first layer. This will harden and then I'll come back and do just like another layer on top of it and then it'll look all smooth and whatever. Um, so I'm gonna try and make space for this. And the if you hear that, Jared is down here vacuuming at 1 a.m. But he's cleaning the basement and filling the Easter eggs room. I asked him to film, so let's see if he actually films. But let's make some space. We made it fit. We made it fit. We made it fit. Okay. I'm going to close that gently. I mopped actually the entire floor. So I'm waiting for that to dry. I'm going to ice the cake. So let's get that out. I actually cleaned this entire level other than vacuuming because it is now 2.45 in the morning.